So 343 just released an update to the Master Chief Collection, which brings Flood Firefight and campaign crossplay. No, I'm not making this up, and it is 2022. So let's get right into the details. So here it is, proof, yes, there was an update that just went live on the MCC. The biggest thing, obviously, is Halo 3 ODST Flood Firefight has gone live on the game. This also brings elites to new Mombasa for the first time and a new Firefight game variant, Blood fight. Which if you guys remember, we did flight this way, way back then. And like, yeah, it was all right, but there wasn't really a dedicated game mode for Flood Firefight, so I couldn't really test it out super well. Now we have a dedicated game mode for Flood Firefight, and I'm definitely gonna be playing this. I'll be uploading a video, giving my impressions about it as well. We'll do a live stream of the Flood Firefight with you guys as well on Tuesday night. So if you want to take part of the Flood Fighting festivities, make sure you give me a follow on my Twitch channel, link in the description and pin comment down below. Also just like low key, now all the games are available for the custom game browser where it says we're here all titles in the master chief collection are now available to, for use in custom game browser sessions which that's like a massive change of pace right there for sure and they'll saying a quick match option has been added to the custom game browser as well it says this allows players and their party members to enter a match that fits their selected filter options without browsing the full list of available sessions so just like if you want to just jump in just play something that fits your you know settings jump in and play and i know this has been a highly highly requested feature for myself included saying that the cross platform co-op for halo 3 and halo 3 odst has gone live now, this is a experimental setting right here so then basically they're saying right that like yeah pc players and console players can now finally play with each other with halo 3 and halo 3 odst now they did say that they did test this feature internally but it does require some additional insights for real player difference network setups and so if you have any come across any kind of issues or bugs make sure to report it to the halo support site now they don't mention anything about the networking improvement because that's pretty much like the biggest issue when it comes to playing co-op campaign for me is online is that the, the person who's not the host is playing a horribly laggy experience. I mean, that's kind of like how it was also back in the original 360 days, but at least it was available, right? I'll definitely have to jump on with some friends and uh, give you guys my thoughts and opinions about this update. Campaign customization for Halo 4 has also been updated, saying when starting Halo 4 mission, enable the campaign customization option, see equipped weapons, skins in game. So that's awesome. So you bring your character customization into Halo 4, that's really cool. New skulls were added for Halo 2 Anniversary, Halo 3, and Halo 3 ODST. They were saying that the Acrophobia skull has been added to Halo 2 Anniversary, and 16 new skulls have been added to Halo 3 and Halo 3 ODST. All you gotta do is if you wanna know exactly what's available for you guys, well, they have it the list here on the support site, which I will link in the description down below if you do wanna check out all the lists, but basically, that's all of them right there. Like that's a whole lot of extra content added into Halo 3. We have new medals added into Halo 3 as well. Like this is a crazy, like unexpected huge update just launched on Monday with original plus medal option. The new original plus option for the unified medal display settings will show Halo 3's original multiplayer medals with their original artwork and three of the newly added medals, headshot, assist, and super combine. Again, you can find this under your video settings. Oh, and just like low key, like mod tools are now available for Halo 3 ODST. Like this update was just like surprisingly huge, like minimal up like information and minimal news, minimal ramp up to get people excited about this. Like I put an update about the flood firefight coming to the MCC like on Friday and then on Monday, the update goes live. Also throughout this blog, they give you a ton of different issues that were fixed globally and also per game. Now this is all just kind of minor stuff like lightning changes and maybe some technical issues that weren't really something you know worth mentioning but if you want to check out all that information again link in the description down below you will find this blog update but that's you know a lot of it's just kind of you know minor things and nothing really too crazy that's like worth like oh my god i need to play the game now kind of stuff but you can see like a lot of fixes <laughs> and this update came at just the right time because right now there is a sale for the mcc i believe it's selling for like 15 bucks on steam and stuff like that to where now since a lot of people are jumping in to play the mcc since it's on sale it actually has surpassed the halo infinite populations on steam during like the more lower hours like obviously the peak population hours still dominated by halo infinite but now you're starting to see the point where mcc is starting to kind of creep up on to the uh halo infinite experience which now with this flood firefight i could totally see like at least like a full day of mcc being more popular than halo infinite because well mcc got new content and we're still waiting for the content for halo infinite so 
that's where, where we're at right now. Again, like I said, we will be doing a game night Tuesday night on my Twitch channel, guys. Make sure to follow me there to know when we do go live. We'll definitely have to play some Flood Firefight and some campaign co-op for Halo 3. But if you're new to the channel and missing any content from me recently, check out this playlist right here. I can link to all my Halo Infinite news and informational videos right there. Thanks so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Catch you on the next one. Peace out.